Question 393. How do Christians assist someone who is dying? Christians do not leave a dying person alone. They help him so that he can die in faith-filled trust, in dignity and peace. They pray with him and take care that the sacraments are administered to him at the right time. If you're with a person who is dying, what do you do? Be with that person and make sure he or she gets the needed sacraments from a priest. What sacraments are given to a Catholic person who is dying? There is something called last rites, which includes the sacraments of confession, anointing of the sick, and the Eucharist with prayers. This helps prepare the dying person for eternal life. If the person is not a Catholic, we still are called to show them dignity respect, and love. Doing what we can to help the person have companionship and compassion during their final moments on earth. Question 394. How do Christians treat the corpse of someone who has died? Christians treat the corpse of a dead person respectfully and lovingly, realizing that God has called him to the resurrection of the dead. It is a traditional part of Christian funeral customs for the remains of a dead person to be buried in a dignified manner in the earth. and for the grave to be decorated and tended. Today, the church also accepts other funeral arrangements. For instance, cremation, as long as they are not interpreted in a way contrary to the belief in the resurrection of the dead. That also means not scattering a person's ashes over land or water, or combining a person's ashes with the ashes of another person or an animal. The ashes need to be contained in an urn and interred in a specific, permanent, dignified place. For example, a mausoleum, or a cemetery, not in a person's living room or office or backyard or any other place that is not permanent and noble. Hi. I'm Katie Locus. This is my sign name. I'm from the Archdiocese of Kansas City in Kansas. Thank you so much for watching our video this week. Hope to see you again next week. Bye!